Boris Johnson has been ordered to walk away from Brexit talks as the European Union ignores the negotiation deadline. Trade talks had been expected to come to an end tomorrow but neither side has been able to come to any agreement. A Brexit no deal is looking more and more likely. Last month, the Prime Minister gave the EU until October 15 to secure a post-Brexit trade deal with the UK. If a pact was agreed, it would have allowed time for both parliaments to ratify an agreement before the end of the transition period in December. But the EU's chief Brexit negotiator Michel Barnier appeared to snub Mr Johnson's October 15 deadline when he vowed to work on a trade deal over the coming days and weeks. An express.co.uk poll, which ran from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. today, asked whether the Prime Minister should walk away from talks. The poll received a staggering 13,052 votes with 98%, 12,685, ordering the Prime Minister quit the negotiations. Just 2%, 327, said no while only 40 said they didn't know. One reader said, the EU are deliberately dragging out negotiations both to see if the UK will start making concessions as they now know the UK does not want to leave without an FTA and also to see if a change in US presidency with its possible implications for a UK-US trade deal will happen in early November. A second person said the EU will not take the UK, seriously, until we walk away. They said, the EU will not take us seriously until we do what we say and walk away they might then wake up. If you say it you have got to mean it and you have got to do it. A third said Britain must not give in to their dominating and bullying antics. They said, Boris might as well walk away today as at the end of the month and save a bit of time that can be used to prepare ourselves. The EU are not going to give us a deal that is worth the effort of going through the motions any longer. We must not give in to their dominating and bullying antics as we have done in the past. It will be difficult for us for a while with all that is going on but it will be better to have a clean break and let both sides simmer down and perhaps revisit talks next year when they have had a taste of no fishing and we are paying tariffs. A fourth reader added, for goodness sake, how much more of this?